What's going on guys, Shane here. Today we're gonna go over some footwork drills to work on your agility and balance. Let's do it. All right, so the setup that we have down here is just four boxes on the ground. You can do it with tape like I have here. You can use chalk if you have an agility ladder or something to lay down, that works too. How I set it up is just four even boxes and it's pretty much just the width of my stance. All right, you can adjust it with chalk or with tape to however works for you. It's about a foot and a half apart from each. The first drill that we're gonna do is a pivot drill. I put my foot dead center of the X and we're just gonna pivot 90 degrees. As soon as our rear foot hits the ground, I want you to throw three punches, okay? So I pivot 90 degrees on my, let's say a hook, and then I throw one, two, three punches. Pivot again, one, two, three punches. I can go back in the other direction as well to here, pop, 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 and again, pop, pop, pop. There's a great one that you can do, just set a timer for about two minutes, three punches every time your rear foot hits the ground. The next one is a box drill. So we're gonna start in the lead right box Whatever direction you go in, that's the foot that moves first. I'm going to the left and my left foot goes first. And my right foot follows evenly. If I go out to the right, my right foot moves first. If I move back, my rear foot moves back. If I go forward, lead foot moves forward first, okay? It's a good habit to get into, especially as beginners, you don't wanna crisscross your legs. When you get a little bit more advanced, there will be times that you do crisscross, but that's for a later video, okay? On this one, I want you to punch while you move. So if I'm going forward, I jab, I go out to the left, I jab, and if I go to the right, I cross, or backwards, I cross. Now we're gonna combine them for the third drill. So every time your foot hits any of the T's or the X's, that's when you can pivot, okay? Or you don't have to pivot at all. You can just go in, back, side to side. But like I said, if we wanna combine it and we wanna work our angles, our pivots, and our forward and back side to side movement, this is where it all comes together. So I go here, one, two, three. Step forward, one, two, three. Pivot, one, two, three. Step, punch, one, two, three, pivot, one, two, three. Again, this is a great one just to make sure that you are using the reference down below, but you're not looking down. You don't want to get a habit of doing this because then you're going to do this in a fight. You want to look forward and you just want to use your peripherals to make sure you're on the right spots, right? Boom, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. You can combine some head movement as well, some defense. This is a great place to start, great for beginners. Just use it as a reference, but again, don't get in the habit of looking straight down. All right guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to check out fighttips.com for more footwork drills that you can do at home to improve your agility and balance. Until next time, I'm Shane with Fight Tips. Self-defense for the underdogs.